Articat gave two regular guys one mission to complete, share our passion. The catch? Experience at 11,000 feet up in the Continental Divide in Wyoming with some of the best Team Arctic riders in the world. Good luck, boys. Hey guys, Aaron Scheel, Team Arctic. How are you? How you doing today? Nice to meet Good. you. Welcome to Togarty, Wyoming. Thank you. Up on Angle Mountain, about 11,000 feet. What wow. do you think? Pretty amazing. Pretty amazing, isn't it? Beautiful. So, you guys about ready to get this Arctic Cat the ultimate experience underway? Yeah. yeah. You sure? Yeah! <laughs> Arctic Cat technology gets you riding anywhere the snow is falling with a totally new category. Introducing the new Crossfire Hybrid for 2006. You spoke and we listened. You wanted a powerful sled to ride on the trails and in the mountains. Well, here it is, the powerful Crossfire. The Crossfire was a 2005 mid-year intro, but we consider this bad boy too good to be true. Built with an M-Series inspired chassis and a 136 inch track length. Designed with a more rider forward position. And it gives you everything you need for any type of terrain, including mountain handlebars. The all new Crossfire models are available in black or orange. Nothing stands in the way of our engineers, not even Mother Nature. Arctic Cat engineers have turned their brilliant ideas once again into reality, with many advances for the 06 performance sleds. Once you pin the throttle, you'll understand what we're talking about. Introducing the Firecats for 2006. Advanced technology. Superior design. Razor sharp handling. High performance. Smash it all together and you have the Firecats for 06. Our refined suspension and handlebar and brake design gives you unbelievable cornering, so start carving those trails up. The awesome ZR900 for 2006. At Arctic Cat, we're perfectionists with everything, and the ZR900 is living proof. Sabercats for 2006. Every feature gives you in the trail something to remember. A 
available in three distinctive models and colors. The powerful Turbo ST for 2006 is ready to blow you away. This unbelievably quiet four-stroke Turbo ST will surprise you in so many ways this year. Everything has been tested again and again to ensure you have plenty of get up and go. The Value Pack Zs for 2006. Pure excitement is designed into every Z this year. These trail sleds give your family a smooth and thrilling ride. And the kid-friendly F120. The F120 is available in green or orange this year. It's time to separate the men from the boys. The Arctic Cat M Series for 2006. It's just another year to impress everybody is the way we look at it after our M7 was the 2005 sled of the year by Snowgoer Magazine. And our engineers did it with the popular and patented Act Diamond Drive. With our top-of-the-line track options, featuring a TAC-20 tracks for deep and intense powder riding, or versatile camouflage challenger tracks for any type of terrain, and minor tweaks to the many unique features that made the M7 the very best of 05. The almighty King Cat for 2006. Once you feel the impressive horsepower on this legendary mountain machine, you'll understand why it's everything but typical. Take your passion for mountain riding and let's see what you're made of. Arctic Cat is changing the touring experience with technology in 2006. The sophisticated T660s for 2006. Arctic Cat is giving you even more this year on the new T660, complete with electric start, reverse, mirrors, and new for 2006 CatCom our fully integrated two-way communication system. Now enjoy driver-to-driver -driver or driver-to-passenger communication down any trail. Plug in through our new exclusive Crosstech VRE helmet or by retrofitting your existing helmet with a specially designed adapter kit. CatCom is compatible with AM, FM, and satellite radio or plug in and rock out to your favorite tunes on any MP3 player. Our automatic voice override feature allows you to talk to your passenger while listening to music seamlessly. When you need to talk to another rider equipped with CatCom, all you have to do is push a button on our easy to use handlebar controls. This two-way communication system has amazing range and features 15 clear channels. And to make your ride even more pleasant, we've added new heated seats. With all the excellent features and the addition of CatCom, the new and improved T660 will take your touring experience to a whole new level. The value-priced Panthers for 2006. Introducing the all-new 660 four-stroke to the line of Panthers. This year, our engineers have made this sled more affordable than ever while still giving you the features you have come to expect on the Panther. Utility Touring, the Bearcats for 2006. What's new for the Bearcat this year? Well, pretty much everything. 
The Bearcat lineup is exceptional this year with smooth towing power and plenty of storage space on our new and improved rack system. Your touring experience on the trail will never be the same again. That's not a promise, it's a guarantee. Pure power. Agility. Handling. Comfort. Performance. All were perfected through Arctic Cat technology. There's nothing more important to us than being passionate about state of the art technology. We have enhanced the snowmobiling experience in every category and can't wait for you to experience it for yourself. At Arctic Cat, we design the best so you can experience only the best. When you look at the technology Arctic Cat has brought to the table, you can understand why we want every rider to share our passion. From our lay down engine design to our Air Force induction and our weight saving Act Diamond drive, every year our technology speaks volumes and this year isn't any different. Here are some of our remarkable innovations for 2006. Introducing the all new Crossfire. Our engineers have outdone themselves and created one awesome hybrid sled to tackle both the trails and the mountains. Complete with the exclusive M-Series inspired chassis, a more rider forward design and equipped with mountain handlebars. With razor sharp handling on the powerful and lightweight Firecat this year, you're going to make the snow bleed. The advancement of the AWS-6 front suspension and the industry's best handlebar and brake design gives you more control and allows you to turn on a dime. The 06 M Series, 2005 Sled of the Year by Snowgoer Magazine, continues and then surpasses its reputation in 2006. Featuring the Attack 20 track for deep and intense powder riding or the versatile Camoplast Challenger track, great on any type of terrain. The trail rider will appreciate a whole new experience with our new fully integrated CATCOM, the first ever standard two-way communication system designed for snowmobilers. Now enjoy driver to driver or driver to passenger communication down any trail. Plug in through our new exclusive Crosstech VRE helmet or by retrofitting your existing helmet with a specially designed adapter kit. CATCOM is compatible with AM, FM, and satellite radio, or plug in and rock out to your favorite tunes on any MP3 player. Our automatic voice override feature allows you to talk to your passenger while listening to music seamlessly. When you need to talk to another rider equipped with CATCOM, all you have to do is push a button on our easy to use handlebar controls. This two-way communication system has amazing range and features 15 clear channels. And to make your ride on the trails even more memorable, we've added heated seats to the entire line of the T660s. Three different temperature settings will ensure you, and you know who, will be comfortable and warm during your whole adventure. Speaking of being comfortable, check out the new line of Arctic wear and accessories. It's better and warmer than ever. Every stitch is designed by real snowmobilers to ensure style, quality, and of course, being toasty and every part is enhanced to make your overall ride a true Arctic experience. Arctic Cat technology, man, it's a beautiful thing. Arctic Cat technology starts with our engineers and gets fine-tuned by our test pilots. Team Arctic riders like Curtis and Sean Crapo, Ian Hayden, Kirk Hibbert, 
Trevor John, Robbie Melanowski, Ryan Simmons, and PJ Wanderscheid. No matter if they're freestyling, jumping, climbing, racing, or dragging, they push the latest designs to the max to ensure you only the very best. Not only do they test our technology to the limit, they show everyone why Team Arctic is considered the team to beat. doesn't get any better than this. America's finest snowmobile destination, Togadee, Wyoming. Powder up to your armpits and every sled imaginable from Articat. Riders Scott Lee and Paul Sam of Minneapolis were lucky enough to be selected to experience this beauty firsthand and to find out what passion is all about. Oh, did they ever. Got up about 4 a.m and uh, went and picked up Paul. What do you feel like? I feel really excited. <laughs> you got snow up there or what? You yeah, feel right? there's snow. Absolutely fantastic, huh? That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, man. Isn't that beautiful? That's Unbelievable. just my game. My cell phone rang, and it was an old high school girlfriend of mine called and said, told me about this audition. She didn't know much about it, so she said, call the guy. So he did that, and he said, bring a buddy. You got to bring a buddy. And then I finally got a hold of Scott. I knew that he did a little bit of sledding, so. He says, OK, I'll, I'll, I'll meet you there. So we went there, and we got there a little early and had a couple tall beverages. <laughs> and got a little giddy and went into the interview. And... <laughs> <laughs> Paul, what kind of sports do you like? Uh, football, hockey, all sports. Oh, baseball. she ain't no good in sports, I, dude. I dominated all of them. <laughs> <laughs> Ginger or Marianne? Marianne. Marianne, no why, doubt about why, it. Oh, yeah. Why? Oh, that dirty little country little thing. <laughs> why? Why? Home, home cooking. Home cooking. <laughs> home cooking. We made it, dude. We're here. We're here, baby. All right. Woo! Started to see more and more snow, and we started coming up, and there was more and more snow, and snowmobile tracks, and then bang, Articat, everything. Wow, finally. Hi. Scott, Hi. Paul. I'm Paul. You're Paul. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is. And you're Scott. How are you, sir? Hey, I'm doing great. I'm My pleasure. <laughs> VP of Sales and Marketing for well, Arctic we're, Cat. We're honored and pleased well, that you <laughs> chose us to come and ride your sleds. Well, we're, listen, we're, let me we'll tell you, you something. Right. We are so privileged to have you here to help us share our passion. Yeah, right. Let me tell you, you guys have hit a perfect day. The conditions could not be better. There's two semis, there's Warren Miller television, there's helicopters, there's every kind of sled you can yeah. possibly think of. You can see a little more rider forward positioning. You've got yeah. the, uh, there you go, the uh, mop and handlebars on them. Yeah, like this. So, sure. you know, you got a perfect cross between both sleds there. Awesome sled, you guys are gonna love riding cool. that one. Can we beat on it? it? Is. Oh yeah. <laughs> are you kidding That's what me? That's here for. They're here for you guys to do your thing on them. <laughs> All right. <laughs> 
I'm gonna wet my pants. You guys ready? Yeah. We're going, uh, welcome to Togety. We're here, we're gonna get you guys all suited up with helmets and gear and boots no and all way. that kind of stuff and do a little spin. I'm there. I'm there. All right. Let's go. Here we go. <laughs> all right. Woo! Let's go. So you walk in and there's just gear everywhere. And then it's like, point at that. Says, oh, you want that? Point at, oh, tables you want that? Tables and tables. It's like, really? Yeah. You have to wear that? Yeah. Okay. All right, so here we are, Togety Lodge, it's 5 a.m. We're gonna go wake these guys up, the guys. And I don't think these guys are used to having a camera. Waking them up out of bed, that's their alarm clock. Rise and shine, gentlemen. <laughs> Time to get up! Turn that f thing off. <laughs> Time to get up! And that was fun, staging all these sleds in the dark. Pretty cool. I think we got some good shots. It was a lot of fun. I'm I had no idea how we were going to get everybody in line and all the way up to the top of the mountain in the dark, but we did it. Woo! This is awesome. Look at that. That's where I want to go. I want to go up there. It brought us up on top of Angle Mountain, 11,000 feet. Scott and I are standing there looking like looking at each other and all of a sudden this helicopter shows up and starts flying around us and it's, it's like, wow, unbelievable. Look at that thing. But this crossfire, I gotta tell you, Articat has outdone themselves with this machine here. I'm gonna put this one on my Christmas list there for Santa Claus, I think. This sled. Kicks ass. This thing's got so much power. They're so responsive. Suspension is like makes these bumps, these really hard bumps, and makes them smooth and creamy. Just try to follow that straight line as much as possible, straight up that hill, and you're gonna have to reference off of that line. And then ride through the woods and then ride across the field with the helicopter 30 yards from you as you're going about 50, 60 miles an hour. I mean, I can't believe I get to say that now. I rode with the helicopter chasing me. Look at the clouds down there. We're way up above the clouds now. Yeah. Beautiful thing. Wow. Can't get much closer to heaven than this, I don't think, huh? <laughs> Felt like I was part of the Articat team. All the major riders were there. All the new sleds were there. They made us, everybody was professional. It made us feel really part of the team. <laughs> <laughs> is that cool or is that cool, dude? It made you really feel at ease, too, so there, there was no pressure, no stress, and uh, a lot of fun, too. I was joking and kidding and <laughs> wrestling around in the snow when, when in the downtime, because there is a lot of standing around, but it was fun. Uh, Articat really, <laughs> Uh, has a good group of people here that uh, really know how to make novices like myself feel all right. Um, and get this light. Action. You guys about ready to get this Articat Ultimate Experience underway? Yeah. yeah. You sure? Yeah! yeah. <laughs> <laughs> With the helicopter and the racing and the different sleds, the Crossfires, the Sabercats, the M7s, it was awesome, awesome. Changing outfits. Uh, we felt like movie stars today and a real big part of Team Arctic.
We just got out of the lodge. It's about uh, 6 30 in the morning, and I'm telling you, I'm going to have some fun with this thing today. Look at this machine. Fantastic. Got a little light snowfall this morning. It's going to be another banner day out here at Togety on the Cats with Team Arctic Cat. How this thing gets up and goes way, way more than anything I've ever been on. That turbo kicks in, and you got to hang on tight. I don't, I don't understand it. There should be flames coming off the back of this thing right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Staggered is best when, it, when it's kind of like this, you know, one guy's Absolutely. just leading the other guy, okay. and you can kind of switch out. So if, if we do that, Mark, maybe you come racing up, and this guy's here, and then this guy drops back, and you can do this. Well, one moment was he says, okay, come past us, and right when he comes at us, he says, okay, come back, come back, and I'm so drop it back, and the guy riding didn't realize about the, the trailer, the camera, the boom on the trailer. He cuts in front of me, well, the trailer starts cutting me off, and right at the same time, it's like they planned it, but the one guy goes, whoa, and the boom comes right down on top of me. Today was really special. Today we got a good treat. Carve right in the snow. Yeah, and that's the fun part, just carving. Rex Hibbert, the Silver Fox, who was a legend up here, he took us up to the top of the mountain and uh, we got into some uh, three to five foot powder and, and uh, learned how to carve on the M7s. And uh, those sleds were unbelievable. Articat has really, uh, really came up with another gem. It ain't nothing like flat landing on the lakes in Minnesota, I'll tell you that, it's a whole new ball game. He was I talking... challenge anybody to come on out here and bring their ego with them. He was talking... Because we'll leave it on the mountain. The powder was at least, at the very least, two feet. It's gotta be more than that. Why didn't you tell me what this whole thing consists of, this powder, this powder mountain sledding thing? <laughs> <laughs> it was awesome. Scott had a little bit harder time. Um, Excuse me? I just when said, why didn't you tell me what it was all about? I didn't, I didn't ask you to. How was, how was I going to tell you? Yeah. <laughs> wow. That is so fun. Oh, my God. Woo. I can't believe it. I really can't, dude. It's awesome. Awesome. Not <sighs> this sled, <laughs> you, it's so, the snow is so deep, and you lean, and these handlebars, you hang on to them. Absolutely perpendicular to the ground. Carving it up, carving like a knife. You can't believe it, this is, this is heaven. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. You get to the tops of these mountains, or just when you wake up in the morning and you look out the, look out the window and you see the Grand Tetons, it's, uh, it's something else. And then you get, out, uh, you get out on the sleds, you get out on the trails and every corner, every pass, every hill, there's something new waiting for you and it's just breathtaking. It's, it's, it's almost difficult to sled because you want to stop every 100 yards and, and take in the scenery, and it's just absolutely beautiful. Uh, the best part for me, actually, was, was coming back uh, after <laughs> beating the snot out of my body. <laughs> we come back and we get to the, the last ridge, the last hill, and we come up over and the sun setting and the Tetons are right there. It was the most beautiful thing I've ever seen, and we stopped took our helmets off and just admired the beauty of, uh, of our land, and it was awesome. And this experience has been, like no other experience, a paradise up here. The people, places, the sleds are all absolutely incredible. Everything here is breathtaking, phenomenal. This once of a lifetime experience came to an end, and you gotta hand it to both Scott and Paul they really did share our passion. This trip truly epitomizes what Arctic Cat wants for every rider. No matter if you're riding in the mountains, on the trails, or even in the ditches, let Arctic Cat's passion for snowmobiling make your experience one that you'll remember. Oh, and boys, way to go.